Can you tell me a little bit about what that was like? What were you hearing, Edward Timothy? Well, I was like hearing like loud noises. Like, what did you it was, think like, those really were? Loud. What did you think they were? Well, well, at first they sounded like, like, like something like was popping. Like when kind of were, like he, fireworks. Oh, so when you heard the firework type sounds, do you think it was far away from you or close to you? It, it was like, it, I heard like it like a little like far, but I heard it like really loud. So it like was I louder. heard it like following me. Edward Timothy, was your teacher with you First when you heard saw, the sounds? Uh, yeah, well, um, at first, the, a lady came to the, the the classroom and knocked knocked on our doors with a purple shirt. She said, "Go and hide," and we turned off all the lights and went to the back of the classroom and put desk in front of us, and we were hiding. Did you know when the lady with the purple shirt came over? Did you know why you were having to hide and close the door and turn off the lights? Yes, I learned that we were having a, a real drill. Because we've Had practiced a lot, and I think we, we, say, we were safe because we practiced. How many times had you had to practice a drill like that before? Well, we started in kindergarten. How are you feeling now? I mean, did you, how did you sleep last night? Well, I was sleeping with my mom and dad again because I was a little scared. What are you afraid of now, Edward Timothy? Well, I have the fear of um, guns now because I'm scared someone might shoot me. Amber, when you hear your son say that, had he expressed that to you before ever, his, his fear? No. Huh? No, this is my first time hearing this. What's that like hearing that? It breaks my heart. Did you know some of the other children, Amber? Um. No, not personally. I know that this is very emotional. It, it broke your heart to hear your son say he was afraid. Yes. Amber, what do you, what do you want to happen? I just don't want my, because he was asking me, does he have to go to school next year? And I just don't want him to be afraid of school. I want him to continue learning and not be scared, you know, of going back to school. Yes. I want him to have a normal life again. And yes.